guys, it's Sam and I am going to be doing a haul video. I just wanted to share with you some things that I've gotten since my last one. I know I just put one up, but here is another one. Let's get started. The first is actually underwear and I just wanted to show you this, the, which is my favorite. I know that I should be getting more expensive ones, but this is the Brief Hanes Platinum Cotton Creations. And so they're just so comfortable and they're um, just really, really nice to wear. So I thought I would share with you my favorite ones. I get these from Macy's and they have, you know, high briefs, uh, boyfriend shorts, uh, whichever ones you prefer. But I just like the briefs. I don't know why, but not sexy at all. Um, but I'm more comfortable than anything. So these are my favorite. And then next is a few shirts from Macy's they have these really cute floral prints uh, from the brand Style & Co so uh, these two are from like the same line and then there's another one um, so this is the first one here and it's super duper cute and just really comfortable and nice I guess that's the theme of this video is comfort next is this one and they have several of these, um, I think these were the only two floral ones. There might have been a black and white one, uh, but there's other designs. And they're just really simple and just perfect for when you're not sure what to wear and you just you want to put something um, very uh, cute and simple on. And then this is the brand Alfani. And... These again are so comfortable. I don't know. I was I really like this print. I thought it was very tropical. And again, this is flowy. The material is different. The first ones I showed you, the first two are sort of cotton, and this one has a little bit more stretch to it. And it hangs really nicely on the body. The back there's I don't know if you could tell. There's this thing right here when I pull it open. And it's just really nice. I, you know, I say, I've said this so many times, but I work with kids and you want to be comfortable. You don't want anything tight or you have to like fuss with it. So I, that's why I, when I saw those, I picked up several. And then this is a bra, um, not a, a sports bra by Under Armour. And it looks like this. And I thought this was so pretty just in case I ever happen to. I usually wear sports bras to go to bed or if I work out ever, I will wear a sports bra. Um, but this one is just, I thought it was really pretty and I love the geometric-ness uh, that it has. So I got this and I love this color. And then um, next we have some, uh, this is a hair band, headband from J. Crew, And I have a big one that I love, but I wanted something with a little bit more, it's a little bit smaller and um, it's a turquoise print. They had, I think they had a black one and then they have this one just in case you were interested in that. Very, very comfortable. I don't know why. Head I have several headbands, but when I put them on my head, they give me a headache. So when I find one that's comfortable on my head, I uh, am more likely to get it. And then this is for kids, but I thought it was so cute. Um, I, You know, when I wear stuff like this, the kids love it and I just... Uh, there's a pretzel and a pizza. Those are probably going to be some uh, fan favorites. And then watermelon earrings. These are for kids as well. But I, my ears are so sensitive. Oh, hello. My ears are so sensitive that I, not that these are, you know, 24 karat gold. Um, but they're better material for my ears than let's say Claire's or which I'm going to show you something from Claire's. I, don't, I think that's why I mentioned Claire's. Um, I don't mean to single out Claire's but um, you know H&M Forever 21 that jewelry uh, it's just it's the material isn't as good but it just it happens or it doesn't happen so I don't know my ears are super duper sensitive. Uh, Claire's uh, these are so cute I don't care if they're going to hurt my ears or not but look they're boxes with glasses on them how cute that's for my sister so thank you if you're watching um and then she also got me this mint green choker i'm still trying to uh i have a bunch of chokers and i have to get over the hump of oh my neck feels like it's being squeezed or something like that because they are so cute and i really like the way that they look but after a few hours i'm like pulling on it and i just eventually take it off 
my sister also got me a present. I went full time a few months back. Um, and so she got me um, these unicorn makeup brushes. And they're just so awesome. And they're super soft. I believe she got them from eBay. But I'm so excited. Look at the handles. They are so amazing. So I'm really, really excited about these. Again, thank you. And then... Uh, I, I have, for some reason, I got obsessed with eBay a few weeks back, which is kind of dangerous because because you think, oh, it's only 99 cents or a dollar, and then you end up spending more money because you're just buying a bunch of things. Uh, I picked up this purifying peel-off mask. It's the black mask, and it's by Shells or Shills. Shills? Uh, it's very much like the Bosha one and um, this one doesn't smell scary or anything. It actually has a floral fragrance which is quite nice. I just tested it on my hand but I thought it was going to be this terrifying experience but it's really not. It's very similar to the Bosha one. Um, this is obviously less expensive um, but yeah it's nice to have another one of these black ones. It's just so satisfying to put it on your face and then to peel it off. Me, I I have large pores, but nothing comes out of them whenever I do like Biore strips. I know, humble brag. Um, next is a bunch of things from uh, the store Target. Yeah, I got this. I think I, I'm not sure if I showed it in my last haul, so I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself. Uh, this is a Tresemme Keratin Smooth I. I think I did show it but uh, I just use this and I feel like I need to use a lot of this so we'll see how it ends up being um, if I like it better than the Chai Chi one which I really really love their hair oils I'm starting to put everything on the side and it's all gonna fall over so let me start putting it someplace else uh, this is kind of random but I got a moleskin notebook love this color and I don't know I just I shouldn't be collecting notebooks. It's one of those things that I just tend to collect. Notepads, pads, things like this. So um, this will be my last one for a little bit. Uh, next is... Oh, so I my teeth are not as white as I would like them to be. So I was on Instagram and I had asked this YouTube... Um, she's pretty... Not... She's not the most popular, but a lot of people know her. And I had asked her how she got her teeth so white, not not intending to um, be like, oh, she has to be using something. I just thought her teeth were amazing and they look so beautiful. But I think she got offended because she replied back that she used the Colgate Optic White, which I was so appreciative that she even wrote back. But then she had like this really scary mean face on, like she was annoyed. Um, so I was like, oh, I didn't mean to offend you. I just thought your smile and teeth were beautiful. So um, I'm glad she wrote back, but she was kind of annoyed. So I'm not sure. Um, anyway, she had said she used this for years and I have used this. Um, but I wanted to try it again just because, you know, any little thing helps and I do like to drink coffee. Um, so I think that's a huge part of it. So I'm hoping that this will make my teeth a little bit whiter. And then, uh, I got another, uh, NYX Stay Matte but Not Flat. I think this is probably my favorite powder, uh, from the drugstore. Uh, and this, I am finishing it up that's why I even picked up this one this new one and it looks like this and it's just so velvety smooth and it gives you decent coverage so um, I wanted to have a backup of that although I sh shouldn't be buying backups of anything but it's nice to have a brand new package of this and then I don't use a lot of hairspray but when I do I want something that I don't mind the crunch. I don't want it to look crunchy, but I don't mind if it's like kind of like helmet head. I know that sounds really weird, um, but I need something to tame my flyaways and things like that. And the ones I have are flexible uh, hold, and I just wanted something that was really like going to give me, it's not going to move. So I got the Tresemme Mega Firm Control Trait 2 Spray Freeze Hold, and it's the, no, all the, it's five. It's five, um, the number five. I don't know why I keep on saying the number five, but it's supposed to be really good. So I got that. And then my, I colored my hair because I have grays coming up. And I mean, it's not so terrible, but I feel like I just, you 
know, I just don't. I just want my hair to be all one color, like everybody else. Uh, so I picked up, I was going to get the L'Oreal, the color safe one, the, the red one, I think, the pink, purple bottle. Uh, so this, I saw this and it was a little bit cheaper, so I was like, let me try this first. And it's the Pantene Expert Intense Color Care, and I got the shampoo and conditioner, because I feel like just... Uh, the hair color, I see it going down the drain, and I'm like, let me try to get something that will not do that. Uh, next, the last few things, and things are falling off, so let me pick those up. Okay. So I picked up, um, well, I got this for my sister, so hopefully she'll be home before she sees it. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Cat Suit in um, Nice to Fuchsia. Um, I really like those. Now, they don't stay when I'm eating or anything, but I don't think a lot of lip lipsticks do that. But it does if you are um, just want long-lasting lip color and you're not going to be doing that much eating, um, then it's really great. And I got I got this one for myself. I love these, you know, deep, dark red colors. This is Video Vixen. And, you know, that's why I didn't wear any lipsticks. I wanted to try it on for you guys, the two. So I'm going to try... Um, and I also got the NYX Suede Lip Cream Lipstick in Brooklyn Thorn. And it's kind of like that gray, grayish color, you know, gray and beige. Which is not the best look for me, but I don't know. I really like that color, so I'm like, I'm going to try it. Um, so I'll do this one first. Let's see. I'm going to do this on Oh, no, okay, I could look it right in front of me. Oh, this is really gray. But it has a hint of purple to it. I don't know about this color, you guys. I'm going to put it all over and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I put it on. And I have to say I don't hate it. At first, I was a little bit, oh, I don't know. But I kind of like this color. It has a bit of purple to it. And... Um, it's not obviously for every day, but I kind of like it. So I, um, yes, I'm glad I picked this one up. It's Brooklyn Thorn. I don't know if I'm going to wear it all the time, but I like the color. And then next is uh, Wet n Wild Video Video Vixen. So I will apply this off camera so because I have to take this off because it does dry. Um, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I am back on, well, I'm back with Video Vixen on, and so there's the color. Super dark and just really, really nice. Although I like the Brooklyn, Brooklyn Thorn a little bit better. Uh, maybe I'm just not feeling the dark color today, but yeah, just love these. Um, both of these are really, really nice formulas. Um, they don't last. Uh, they last pretty long if you're not eating or drinking or anything like that. Um, but both, this one is a little bit drier than this one. This is the NYX Liquid Suede and just, I really like these a lot. So, uh, but yeah, that is my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed that and let me know what you've been up to. I know for the Northeast area, we're supposed to get this huge snowstorm on Tuesday. We'll see. Um, I don't know if it's going to be a snow day like it was for the last snowstorm, but we could all hope. And yeah, so if you're in the area, please be safe. And if you're not, I hope that you guys are having good weather and spring is almost here. So I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.